Hey, hi all. Welcome to my new blog, Explore PVC. So, today I'm going to speak about something known as internationally renowned communication platform that is Toastmaster. So, Toastmaster is like the internationally renowned communication platform where speakers are required to exhibit their communication talent in front of the renewed panel or renewed judges what we call in Toastmaster terms as evaluators. So, there are like... Uh, various roles in this like if you take yeah, if you take like club club level roles as well as the uh, meeting level roles so if i come uh, if i come straight into the point like uh, toastmaster like has uh, its uh, communication centers across 127 countries and even india has also like uh, india is also having huge toastmaster clubs and uh, some of the clubs directly registers with the toastmasters and some of the clubs follow the Toastmasters principles. So the difference between these both is like uh, uh, the clubs which are directly following the Toastmasters is that uh, they are direct, they should enroll with the Toastmasters team and then they should uh, like then they are called like Toastmasters club and the club which is not enrolled with the Toastmasters like they are, they can adopt the principles of the Toastmasters and they can run their club independently which follows the Toastmasters principles. So these two are the kind of the scenarios. So like these two scenarios, there are many clubs which are there in India, like which is practicing the Toastmaster principles. So before COVID, like we used to have this platform, offline platform, but after COVID, like now we are running this platform, online platform. So most of the clubs, I think a few of the clubs have started this meeting offline also, but still some of the clubs are running online, like uh, they can join via Google Meet or uh, Google Meet or even uh, Skype Teams or zoom meeting so any of the platform depending upon their requirement or even the geo meet so yeah uh, there are like uh, n number of clubs in india uh, where i told like which are directly registered with the toastmaster uh, organization or which are indirectly following their uh, principles and running the club so uh, if you take in india they like there are uh, the toastmasters is there in major of the cities like delhi mumbai chennai Bengaluru, Hyderabad, so like that, like there are various uh, Toastmaster principles are there and they are following that clubs and uh, if you take uh, in uh, Bangalore only like uh, in, like in each area wise also we're having like uh, if you take some, if I take like Elanka Toastmaster or if I take like uh, uh, Koramangla Toastmaster, so like that the depending upon the area like uh, there will be different number of Toastmaster platforms you can just type in the Google like Toastmasters clubs in Bangalore. You will get various lists. And uh, if you take like one of the famous Toastmaster club is the BTM Toastmaster club. So that is like one of the oldest Toastmaster running club. And uh, they are like enriching the knowledge of the speakers. And uh, they are training in such a way that uh, they can compete uh, at the world world communication levels. And, and uh, they can improve their personality development also. Like Toastmaster is not only like just improving our communication but it, it is like way of building our lives better like way we improve our personality development like if i take like there is one dress code for the men like they should follow this attire called tie and they should follow this blazer and they should follow this normal formals and uh, how they present themselves and how they talk while talking what is this uh, while talking in a speech what is their uh, body language movements hand gestures and uh, eye movements so what is this uh, different uh, body languages and what is this voice modulation so various things like with respect to the personality development like uh, it is like very very good platform and uh, we can utilize it a lot and apart from that one like uh, we can even like indulge in uh, different uh, leadership skills also like in our career like to build ourselves like we need these leadership qualities so coming forward and uh, doing this different kind of roles exhibiting our talent it also improves in our career also with respect to personality development and even with respect to the leadership skills also to grow ourselves in, in our office or in our professional career. So that is the main use of this, uh, what, what are this multilingual communication clubs which are directly shared with the Toastmaster or which are indirectly following their principles. So now if I talk about the club level rules, like in club club level rules, like uh, there will be one tenure, like one, one fixed tenure, like uh, some clubs may use like two months or three months or four months or six months or one year it depends upon the type of the club so uh, 
in the tenure like there will be one fixed president fixed vice president fixed uh, secretary and fixed sergeant at arms so president is responsible for starting like he should ensure smooth handling of that uh, meeting and he is he is like the decision maker like uh, what are all the subject what is the subject of the meeting and uh, what would be the um, like uh, how the meeting should be conducted so pres president should should start the meeting like uh, during uh, at any of the meeting like pres president should open the meeting and uh, he should address the members and he should give warm welcome and he should declare the meeting open and he is like the complete decision maker like uh, whatever the uh, like many of the members can give their session but the final decision is given uh, it should be taken by the president only so president is like the main pillar of the club in during the tenure whatever the three or four months and vice president uh, the role is uh, the role of the vice president is uh, like the acting pre president so the next uh, the next uh, decision whatever the president has taken will be like uh, uh, like uh, reviewed by the vice president and uh, they will play an important role so let us assume that uh, president is absent for one of the meetings so vice president should step up should step up into the shoes of the president and he should conduct and organize the meeting in a uh, organized manner so like starting of the meeting and addressing the committee and uh, ensuring that meeting is going on smoothly so that is the role of the vice president and coming to the secretary so the secretary should maintain the records of the meeting like uh, what are the minutes of the meeting what we call it right? like if you take in office also we will be meeting something known as minutes of the meeting so that all the records should be maintained by secretary like who, are, who is attending the meeting and what is the members what is the uh, uh, this what, what do you call as uh, what is the attendance of the meeting and what is the minutes of the meeting happened so that and all records should be maintained by the secretary and apart from that uh, there is one more person known as sergeant at arms the sergeant at arms is responsible for starting the meeting so like uh, before president starts the meeting sergeant at arms he should start the meeting and they should start the meeting and they should pass on the meeting to the president so they should uh, uh, ensure that uh, whatever the uh, topic is given that should be introduced and after that they should pass on to the president then president will address the meeting and uh, he will pass on to the secretary and secretary will re read out the minutes of the meeting and like that the program flows so next role which i wanted to explain is the master of ceremonies so master of ceremonies is like the key anchor or the key anchor or the uh, or the uh, person who holds the meeting like who conducts the meeting that is the master of ceremonies so master of ceremonies like he will be conducting the meeting throughout like he will be anchoring the meeting he will be he will be anchoring the complete meeting so that is the master of ceremonies so in master of ceremonies like uh, in short we will be calling it as mc so that, that is the role of the master of ceremonies and uh, coming to the next important role which i wanted to talk about is the uh, general evaluator so general evaluator is responsible for evaluating overall program like how the meeting started how the meeting is going what are all the flaws in the meeting so the general evaluator should uh, give his feedback in a uh, give his or her feedback in a constructive manner like uh, uh, it should not hurt the other sentiments but it should be in such a way that the feedback should be given in a constructive feed, uh, constructive manner so that is the role of the general evaluator and uh, next important role is a table topic master so in school or colleges we used to have something known as pick and speak so pick and speech is like uh, we'll pick one topic and we'll speak so in the two minutes like uh, what uh, what are all that uh, topics they'll give right we should like uh, we should process it and we should deliver it so that is the role of the ta uh, table topic master like you should ensure that you should you will be asking those like those kind of questions like you'll, you'll be conducting the table topic sessions so that is the role of the table topic master and uh, coming to individual evaluator like uh, so now now i will be like dividing into the uh, sessions like before going to the individual evaluator so i'll be dividing into sessions like normally we will be having three sessions in the toast masters like uh, one is the prepared speech table topics and the uh, evaluation so prepared prepared speech is like uh, pre uh, speakers like uh, they'll be uh, informed about the topic well in advance and they should prepare on that topic so usually we will start with something known as icebreaker speech so icebreaker speech is like 
speakers will be introducing about themselves or they will be speaking about themselves so this this speech should follow something known as o opening body conclusion so opening of the meeting then what is the middle content and then conclusion so for that there will be something known as individual evaluator so they will be supporting that one and uh, they will be like evaluating the speech based on the obc principle and then they'll deliver their final verdict like what are all the areas of improvement so those things will be present in the prepared speech and table topics as i told that uh, it will be conducted by table topic uh, mas table topic master and uh, they are only like uh, within 2 minutes we need to pick and speak and general evaluation is like uh, or like general evaluator will conduct a general evaluation session and uh, some one one more important role is like grammarian and word master so grammarian is like uh, you will be checking the grammar like uh, what are the uh, what are the grammar mistakes or any fillers we are using or any of the uh, punctuation errors or any of the uh, like uh, repeated grammar words that are being used or any of the uh, mis miscommunicated words so those with respect to the grammar that will be provided by the grammarian so these are the few important roles and uh, one more role is the timer role like uh, there will be like fixed timing like uh, prepared speech only 10 minutes we need to speak speak table topics only 2 2 minutes charge at a terms like they should introduce the subject and they should pause on to the president like uh, within 2 minutes of time president should speak for only 2 minutes master of ceremonies like overall you will be you should be handling within 5 minutes because timing is one of the most important things like uh, what are the speech we wanted to deliver we should deliver thoroughly and perfectly within that time so that is the role of the timer so these are the various important roles and uh, coming to one more role that is known as treasurer so if you take like uh, the clubs which are registered with uh, with respect to the toastmaster and which are following the toastmaster uh, principle and which is officially re registered with the toastmaster organization like uh, what is that uh, treasurer or what is the money and what is the accounts so that entire will be taken care by uh, taken care by the treasurer so these are the various roles which is which is there and uh, i am part of one of the multilingual communication club so the like i am part of one of the mlcc group which uh, follows the toastmaster principles so as per the uh, guidelines of the club i should not reveal that detail so i am not revealing so yes just i wanted to educate on the like i want to i wanted to educate on the toastmaster principles so do try this toastmasters like it is very very helpful like with respect to the toastmaster platform also we can excel and uh, enrich and we can flourish and uh, even with respect to our uh, what do you call as this uh, uh, this uh, with respect to our personality development and with respect to our improving the leadership skills in future also like we can definitely try this toastmaster so that's it my friends so blog is almost like uh, 13 minutes so i am ending this blog so hope you like this vlog so it was informative and educative i think so please try this internationally re renewed communication platform known as toastmaster so please try and enrich your knowledge and uh, improve your communication skills and uh, improve your personality development and uh, even like uh, improve your leadership qualities to grow further in your career and ladies dress code i forgot to tell like gents they should wear this uh, formal suit tie formal shoes blazer and ladies should wear like no uh, professional like uh, chudidars what we are wearing right so chudidars they should wear so or even the normal uh, traditional sari or the chudidar that is a dress code for the ladies and uh, gents should wear this uh, normal like uh, suit tie formal shirt and pants so that is a trust code of the toastmaster uh, toastmaster sort the clubs which are following the toastmaster principles so that's it my friends so yeah do try this toastmaster and let me know uh, once once you have tried it so yeah that's it please like share and subscribe to my channel explore bbc jai hind